Howdy, Zowdy, big beefy burger buddy, with another episode of the Bonnie Guys Friends. I'm just gonna go ahead and not play Jacob and Esau. I'm like stuck on the harder characters. I feel like I can't be blamed for it too much, you know? They're, they're the harder characters in the game. They're like the actual challenging characters after they removed all the challenge from all the other characters. Um, but we're right here on Bethany, who is definitely the better of all uh, the three real stinker characters I have yet to be uh, most of the completion marks here on the regular uh, characters. Not gonna, not gonna say names. Not gonna say names. <laughs> That'd be it. That'd be mean. You know what? Yeah, no, I'm gonna try to actually just not complain about those characters and just be like... Probably one. How does this look? This probably looks awful for, like... For recording. To just have the game get pixelated like that. See, I think... I like how they redid that. Um, and it looks much better. Um, of course that was going to happen. Like... Divine intervention that's going to have happen. Speaking of intervention. There's an item there. A fruitcake? Yeah. Um I'm for it. I like fruitcake. Um so what that you can sometimes explode. I think um It's just a more violent version of uh what the f It's a more violent version of our favorite item. Um, I was very lucky that that just happened. What's that item called? Uh, one, $3 bill? It's, it's just a more violent version of that. It has some good tier effects. Like, putting aside the, like, meme nature of this item, because, like, it is, it is a lot of memes, uh, there are a lot of really good tier effects in this, in this pool. Um, so like doing that is worth it. Um, so we haven't done the mother section. I don't feel like doing that right now. Doesn't sound like fun to me. So we're just gonna go ahead and do like, probably try to get to boss rush in time. As we have, uh, we, have, we need boss rush done, hush, and, uh, delirium. Maybe I'll go with that, um, and see if we can get there in time. So let's try to go a little faster here. Let's look at these coins. Um, so what do we really want to start? Uh, cause I think, I think re this is not a bad item, honestly. A little scary. I could have yarded that just to guarantee we'd, like, keep it. That would have been a good idea. As, um... As, as some things, I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> Something about how those were, were, uh, just being constant was, like, it was like psyching me out a bit. I think we just do this for that extra. Unfortunately, immediately lose it. Unfortunately, none of them, none of them fell in that hole there. You see that? Um, we just try to like not get hit. This is basically what we got to do now. We want to try to get that angel deal chance. Um, well, that you know, angel deal because you get the angel deal at the start, which is never bad. Tile locking enemies just not dying to fires. It's something something we all we all come across it, you know? Dingle might hit us. It is very possible Dingle could just hit us. Let's just try to get some of this stuff out of the way. I think just to try to guarantee um that we don't get hit. Now nah, we got this. This is easy here from now on. I was gonna, I was gonna hit a couple of the space bars, just to get some like things that will prevent us from getting hit by a uh, projectile. But honestly, the thing that's probably gonna hit us like most likely is if he did a charge attack, which he didn't do one at all. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and get this. Not terrible. Certainly not terrible. Um. It's nice that we get to keep it on our item. That's pretty nice that we also get it early. I'm gonna try to get this bomb. It might be a little risky. I don't think we can get it now. Well, actually, yeah, we can. If we do this. 
Uh, was it worth it? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not at all. I forgot I had that, uh... Eternal Heart, so we just don't get that. Should've yarded it. Uh, what's she gonna do? So we, do we use Eden Soul in this uh, item room if we can, or do we try to get go for like another angel deal? I think we just go for the uh, the item room one. S Soul of Isaac. Soul of Isaac would be really good. Um, with that Eden Soul, which is unfortunate um, that we don't get to really do that. I mean, we could have duped um. There's so many things I could have just done with this yard room that would have probably been better. Let's go into the shop. Let's just see what's in there. I'll probably just yard of that. Get some consumables. Uh, we have 15 cents. I feel like that's worth doing. The stars for next floor. Um, yeah, I'll do that. I will. I'll definitely do that. We're a little slow. Five minutes on uh, basement two, I'd say, is like probably a minute behind. But we do have like seven items, and like every single one of them are pretty good. Uh, let's just use this. That's also not bad. Can't even do that. Um, I think we just do item rooms, like item room items. For this Eden Soul, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Um, not terrible, and and weird uh, are the two two things. So like the obvious thing is like that's a good amount of damage, obviously. Um, and now we, the thing is we don't cast as many like tier effects, but we also have the luxury of um, certain tier effects just doing a crazy amount of damage. Just like this gentleman here. Uh, and now we have infinite bombs, which might also be, like, really good. Uh, I think I think number two is not that bad of an item. You just gotta remember you have it. Um, thankfully we didn't get hit there. I mean, it doesn't matter too much if you get hit on these first couple of floors. This low uh, angel deal chance probably means we're not gonna get an angel deal. I'm not gonna really try to hold my hopes up for that. I almost like panicked. Very close to getting hit several times. Now I'm not gonna say like, hey, um, it would be really cool if I did get an angel deal, despite these uh these odds. I'm going to try to bomb this guy as many times as I can. Unfortunate that you're you're where you're at. That does do a lot of damage. Like, that's a crazy amount of damage. Hopefully this bomb will kill him. Did not. Not a bad floor. Uh, really good item, actually. Abundance, again. That's not bad, either. But I say we just go. Try to make up for some lost time. Get to that delirium fight. Uh, that's really good. What? A little spewer, not a terrible trinket. Um, soul of lost. I don't want to take it. Maybe we can get him to uh, turn to a funny version. Or definitely uh, better tr familiars, but again, little spewer. I'm gonna take a little spewer. See, is that thing I was talking about last run? Where like, hey, it creeps like creeps actually pretty good when you can constantly do it. With the obvious caveat of, um, hey, you got a, you got these things called flight. <laughs> um, but yeah, like right there, that's that's not bad. Or you hit just a bunch of guys. A lot of enemies in the game with it, that. That's a particularly good effect. That's completely useless to me. I'm gonna go ahead and be really mad about that fact that I just I got that see that thing in in my item pool even to begin with. Maybe this Yara rune's not worth carrying over, like, an Emperor. Maybe just hold the Emperor card and then try to, like, beat the boss first, and then go back. I 
Algis. I'm gonna go ahead and take Algis. Um, and then I'm gonna use Al Al Algis A. Just because I don't want to have to try in this room. And then we're gonna go back and grab that. No, well, actually, I'll, I'll take this instead. And then, uh, cross our fingers. Almost got hit by that, but I had a flame, so I'm actually, like, I'm actually, like, epic for not getting hit there. I don't even think I had a soul heart. Just another opportunity of losing. See, I, I'm using, like, I like to say diet sacred heart with immaculate heart. Just think of, like, any a tier effect that this item gives, and yeah, I'll just call it, like, the diet version of that. That's, uh, that's what we'll do. Uh, Black Rune, maybe that. Uh, that's insane. I'll take this, gladly. I'll take that 24 damage. In fact, I'll take that 24 damage so so happily that um, I feel like we will easily defeat this angel. Increase that angel deal chance. Thankfully, let me get that bomb. Maybe try to get some charges. I almost walked into that, by the way. We did get one soul heart. It's not bad. I think we honestly take lunch, because after an increase like that, um, survivability is probably one of our more important stats to be working on, as uh, it's a lot harder to increase her base health. The only real problem with this uh, this character right now is the, um, the risk of taking damage. I was gonna say, or this, or this being a health up pill <laughs> and causing our damage to lower, which it's not like damage is like the thing we're lacking, but maintaining that would honestly be like as beneficial as like any uh, in super increase right now. So maybe we'll be able to kill these enemies. I'm like tap shotting. I should be like charging this thing just so we can get that in. Just keep hitting them with the the 10 damage area global hit. I feel like that will be uh, our effective use for damage. Try to hopefully push you into these. If not, I would probably just kill you. Did that? Was that fire? What is happening in this room? I thought that fire just turned into a purple fire. Try to not shoot this thing while it's uh, in, in a diagonal of us. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, that's really strong. Honestly, let's just hit the Yara on this, and um, maybe we can use it on something a little bit better. Maybe get a uh, stat increase for our troubles. A sharp plug is not what we're looking for. Um, box of friends might be though. Box of friends might be like awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and just like bomb this. Oh shit, it's gonna reroll it. I'm dumb. I thought that was a um donation machine when I first glanced at it. Apparently it was not. <laughs> My bad, but not a not a huge problem. Uh, it's kinda lucky that we got that. Uh, we will we'll go back to that in a second. I'll just try to kill war in time. Like the Great Feast. Well, he doesn't know. He's actually making me l late for the Great Feast. I'm also worried about like bombing myself. Very close to hitting me. Okay, so now you're just probably dead. And then Black Room that because I kind of don't want it. Uh, we get some good stats for it. Just gonna. I'm just gonna break these and use bombs. Thanks for breaking my fire, you piece of shit. I almost did it again. I lost another one. <laughs> That's why I don't care about them. Like, who cares? Okay, there you go. There's that damage up you want. Um, we don't even go back for the black rune. Or our item rune. Yeah, fuck them. We're trying to go fast. <laughs> we need to actually beat boss rush. So let's try to, like, be in there with an open mind. We are going to be at, like, 14 damage when we go in there. Uh, but we just take a, like, slightly below average tier rate. So, um, let's look at this positively. We got some good, good stats. 
with really good tier effects when we go in there. Um, and it will stay really good as long as we don't get hit, and as long as we, uh, if, if worst case scenario we do get hit, um, we still have like 14 damage, which is a lot. We're still at like a very high positive on our, on our stats. So I'm gonna try to like not lose my mind when I get hit one time during that, uh, endeavor. Now we probably won't be able to even have that damage boost. Exactly what I'm talking about, like, like just don't worry about it. It's a, uh, it's a privilege to have that. Um. Range down. So we're not gonna worry too much about it. That range down is a little bad. It's a little rough. Very, very, very scary that that champion tried to do that. Thank you, champion, for doing that, though. <laughs> so, I mean... Oh, you get it back? In the room. Okay, that's that's good to know. That was a crazy poison damage. Just one shots that character. Okay, like jump up here. I know you got your like friends. He's like really good at just doing that. I will do the save and quit exploit if you are um, going to keep doing this to me. Oh, there you go. Uh, we need to teleport out. Actually, we're doing boss rush, and we already got the two main things done. We are just going to focus on defeating this boss now. It is blue. Blue mummy. Teal. <laughs> it's, uh, it's teal mom. It's not really teal. It is like a... It is a shade of blue. I just feel like there's a certain like uh, mindset when you say blue mom that like needs to be adjusted for. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and call her teal mom from now on. <laughs> I hope I hope I hope that's uh that's like a fair assessment. I'm gonna take with familiar the I mean like I like Seraphim a lot. I think it's a really good item. Another case of damn. I'm sorry I uh but rerolled that machine by accident instead of um doing what I wanted to, uh which was like buy that 10 cent oh, I didn't mean it would have been 10 cents if that was like a donation should have shot it out of the way honestly just unfortunate um but whatever um let's just try to keep this super high damage for it as long as you can I'll take that hog blast just like hit it I don't know if any of those guys spawn and we'll just do that Still don't have my I, I my YouTube description for these videos is uh, I have the mods I use normally. I still have forgotten to uh, enable them. I I'm gonna go ahead and enable them as soon as I have the opportunity to. But I think if you play online, you have to have them disabled because like um, obviously uh, when you have different data than the people playing the game, maybe things aren't gonna work correctly. Don't like brimstone me. You can do this in the corner. Where you belong. Just grab this. Damn, I got hit by the eyeball. Well, now I put a thing on the floor that I don't want. So, <laughs> just don't walk into that, I guess. Okay, let's just kill Gloat. I should hit Bloat with that super high damage. There you go. Um, and now we just try to hit this thing. So this isn't going to give us our damage boost back, which is fine. Um, you're going to kill that boss instantly. Yeah, there you go. He's gone. Um, and now we just deal with Monstro. I don't know if we'll be able to do Hush in time. I think we're pretty good on track. I mean, 10 minutes to do uh, the Womb Floors is probably not going to be that bad. It's usually really manageable. It's just like when you do all of this in one, yeah, you, yeah, you, you do the thing where I do. We don't even have to do boss rush. See, I'm in the brain mode where you like you need to do everything. I guess this is just for fun. <laughs> My, I, am I not on point right now? Okay, I, you know what? It, excuses. Here we go. I'm gonna hit you with them excuses. It's been a minute since I played this game. <laughs> What is also like 9.15? 
like p.m. for me, which is kind of late, especially since it's up a little bit earlier than I normally am. Um, so I'm not. I don't think I'm 100 percent on 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 board. Uh, I want to play the game, but I don't think I'm alert. <laughs> is what it's what's happening. I think, uh, but we got a lot of good, super strong items, so um, like it doesn't even matter how how like just like out of it I am. I'm gonna say there's a high likelihood we win. That's uh, it's not a bad run either. I am just gonna use it. That's 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 just that. That's life. Um. Just to try to speed this up a bit, I don't really think any other boss is gonna like. It'll be use there. It'll be useful against a lot of bosses, um, but this one is going to be a lot of bosses at once. So like, I'm gonna get the most value out of them. Here and now, uh, while we uh, fight, I think we're on like the second to last wave right now. This should be, this should be, actually no, there should be like one more. And then I think we're done. Pretty sure this is it. Uh, where they, yeah, that was more useful there, because like it's going to be used for multiple things. Should we hit vision, because like, who cares. We already know we're taking Pertho, unless we leave this with like, something when you're ready Okay, I guess I was wrong. I just wanted to act like I knew. <laughs> I said, that should be it. That's bad. That's not actually bad either. I like this item. Just go. Just go down that way. I'm, I'm like, I've done all this stuff. Like, I beat Boss Rush, and it's like, I'm on a good pace to try to get the Hutch done. And I'm like, you know what I want to do? I kind of want to do, like, the negative. <laughs> I'm not even like kidding. Like that's I, I'm fully considering just going negative on this one. Um, but you know we've already like done what we need to do to try to not do that. So let's let's at least like do something more productive. I mean, the least productive thing we could do is die. So let's try to just not do that uh, and just carry ourselves with a 16 damage. And again, we're just not gonna be mad that we don't have the double damage. Like, again, it's just a, uh... It's a privilege to have that, so let's try to be grateful for when we do. I really want to make a reference to a character I said I was not going to. Um, so we're just gonna, I'm going, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I have to stick by, I have to, I have to keep my word. <laughs> Let's try to not get something lost to these guys. There you go. Um, I think I just want to hold his, uh, his particular, uh, effect right now. I think that one's one of the better ones. That's, um, that's a library. That could be really strong. Let's see what's in it. Two books. Necro and Anarchist. So now we got Bookworm. So now our damage is basically doubled, even without having that. That's a, probably just a better. I'm gonna hate. I'm gonna hit it. Health down. Uh, it's bad, but like, I think that range up isn't gonna be the worst thing to like get back in return. Cause we need to have kind of low range. Um, and then we do have the Necronomicon. I'm just gonna hit it. Not enough to kill these enemies. Thankfully killed them. Um, justice? Look at that, we got that. <laughs> justice! So death's probably gonna die super easy. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and we guess we, we, we take it. Um, we just go. Yeah, we're trying to get to, uh, hush. Let's do that. Our damage is going to be insane as long as we don't get hit. Um, we got hit, unfortunately. Don't care. Uh, I'm gonna say there's a. We just need to try to get some keys. We need to have seven keys by the end of this floor. 
as like a guarantee. Um, purity, I'll take it. Um, I don't know if I'll use the soul heart I get from it, but I, I don't. I didn't even know if there was a uh, a particular curse on this floor. The sun. Uh, we go back this way. I think we do all the other than the curse room. We go ahead and just like check all this stuff. Like this should be like not that bad. Go in here, try to go find this uh, familiar, and go ahead and see if he gives me like a decent card. Tower's not not a decent card. I would say it's pretty bad. Rarely applicable, but you know, rarely doesn't mean never. Do I actually go in here though? It's always at risk and reward, you know? I think we do the whole floor just to try to see if we can get some extra keys. So we at least got our keys back. Uh, and this is actually going to be really good with... Necronomicon. Pretty sure this is one of the items that boosts its damage by 40. I was just saying we could test it there and then he was a champion, so I just didn't do it. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and just, like, full clear this floor. Just to try to, um, see if we can get... Couple more keys, just as that insurance. Make sure that we can uh, actually open all the doors and chests on the next floor, and then uh, we go for that delirium after we hopefully beat this boss. I think we're in the running to do it. I'm gonna again. I'm not gonna be too mad if I lose the damage bonus because um, one like the uh, the armor is gonna like prevent that from being like truly effective. Um, so ultimately, like, if we lose it, like, it's no big deal. I mean, it'll probably just speed the up boss up by not, like, too much. Definitely help with that first, like, burst. But other than that, before the shield, like, resets on ever, we're just gonna go ahead and try to, um, beat the boss with our super strong status effects. Vision again. Uh, at least we get the super secret room now. Like, infinite bombs is okay, right? Oh, I don't think that's worth it. If you want me to be, uh... If you want me to say my honest opinion, don't think trying to get that thing's worth it. Not when there's a grimace in the room that's, uh, obnoxious. I think obnoxious is the correct word. I'm lucky that I didn't get hit there. Uh, and I think I take the soul of Isaac into this. Or do I? I think... Okay, well... Here's, here's it, right? I think Soul of Isaac will be good to try to get an item. Um, and I guess since I'm not too stingy about what I get... I'm gonna go ahead and say, like, maybe... Maybe this just guaranteed damage multiplier for the, the Hush fight might be the better option. So I'm gonna go with that. Um, just play it a little more safe. Um, worst case scenario, we literally can't get one of those things open. That's incredible. So yeah, we buy that. I'll get a double card. I don't want that to be a telepills and then like teleport me in. I'll probably grab that as I leave. Common cold? I mean, we already have poison. I think it increases poison damage. Um, but, uh, we still have, like, a poison already. And then D4? <laughs> oh, shit, I did it twice. <laughs> okay, I still have the strength card. Um, so yeah, of course I would do, do that, right? Like, that's the reasonable decision to do that? I think they just gave us, like, a bunch of tears. Um, because <laughs> I've like I've hesitated on like too many of these, right? What is even hitting me? All these tiny shitty fires. So I can't like move forward and shoot. Okay, I want this whatever coin is doing that to go away. It's the bomb. It's the one that's shaped like a bomb. All right, give me a second to like delete this one. There you go. It's gone. Um. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, uh, I, I've hesitated too many on too many rerolls, so it's been a minute since I've done that. So obviously, we just keep doing it. Um, it's crazy that like after like one bad East Jacob and Esau run, and one on, uh, honestly do someone that just like unfortunately didn't have the momentum required. Uh, we get comedy. Tears up is insane. I'm just gonna keep getting pills. <laughs> I think we're just gonna keep getting pills. Uh, but other than that, this is actually a really good reroll. What's our luck at? Uh, just default, so we're not really benefiting too much from Evil Eye. I think Evil Eye is pretty good against a couple of the bosses, particularly uh, Hush is probably the best example. Why are the bot enemies invisible? If I start getting hit by invisible shit right there, I was gonna, I was gonna be a little mad. But I guess I'm just killing them. <laughs> Alright. So no uh, no stopwatch this time. Uh, it's all dodge. Dodging is uh, is the key to this one. You can just stand here and I'll be safe until like maybe the small adjustment right there. Um, right here, safe. Okay, right here, safe as well. Getting a little close to the bottom. We're gonna start summoning some flies. Uh, pretty good hush fight so far, all things considered. We have the same damage. We had um, not boosted damage, um, without having to maintain a full red health. Uh, with increased tears and a couple of status effects and familiars that are gonna be, uh, they're they're really just like, like really going to town. Um, it looks like the the Lilith. I didn't know the Lilith thing rerolled. I wonder if it rerolls into other familiars, like guaranteed, or if it just kind of considers it an item room item. Uh, it would be nice if it was only familiars, just because I I like a lot of the familiars in this game. I think a lot of them are pretty reliable. Like, I've always been a defender of Brother Bobby, even when he was, like, the base game Isaac, Flash Isaac, Brother Bobby. Oh, I got hit. Um, probably gonna get hit a couple times. Just because our speed's probably not, like, good enough to be able to do this. Hopefully you don't stay underground for, like, 15 minutes and keep spamming a bunch of, like, the worst things you can do to away. Because there is a chance I just die here. Uh, we do have Leech. Leech would be a good way to get some health back. Leech would be a good way to get some health back. There you go. Okay, did not actually give me a health back. Unfortunate. Let's try to get out of this. Okay, at the very least, we beat Hush. We have Adrenaline. That's why our damage is so high. Um, and then hope that... Oh. So Tears Up would have been really good to pick that up immediately. Pretty fly as well. Just buy this and then donate all my money. Um, let's just try to get some red health back on these, uh, on the void floor. Hopefully we don't die early. I feel like rarely is, um, unless you're playing as, like, Tainted Lost, is this floor particularly bad. Like, the main thing that's probably gonna hit you is... I guess these guys? <laughs> that's what almost happened. That's a bad trip. Okay, so we could actually literally die now. I thought that was a regular grub, like, enemy grub. Trying to come kill me. And I was... I, I like, panicked. Because I'm like, why is it, like, turning? <laughs> it was, like, tinted weird for some reason. Why was that? Um, let's just not die to, like, an invisible enemy on the top of the screen. I am worried. To say I was, I'm not worried is, like, a fallacy. There is a, uh, a, a uh, there is a chance of death instantaneously. I, mean, I, I say instantaneous a lot. But, you know, I want to sound like I'm smart. <laughs> I think... I, we could die. I feel like, we, no, we don't die. You wanna know why? Because we have, like, such high damage. Even if, like, one of these tears comes barreling towards me, 
we're fine. Just don't like brimstone me in the wrong direction. I'm gonna not shoot. I don't know if I can blow myself up for some reason. I mean, yeah, we take it. Like, obviously we take it. And then we reroll it. Uh, what do we get now? <laughs> we got a crown of light again. With yeah, I mean, obviously crown of light's probably not gonna be doing too much for us right now. That's good. That's huge. That's huge. That's huge. Don't hurt me. Again, we have a bomb shooting enemy. Also, you could kill me. And I would not welcome it. It's one of those times where I say like that that reference that like I could end up being killed. And I do not welcome it. At least the flame this time has like more range than like someone who's deranged, you know? So we're probably not gonna get hit uh, because of it. Not a bad reroll, honestly. Also, we have we're we're, we're building up our health. I figured a reroll might be the way we end up building our health. We got Charm of the Vampire, which just gave us some health back. Um, as it, it has stayed true. There you go. There's another one. I think we just kill these poops just to try to get these flies for that extra healing proc. And, uh, another s safety. Sort of, like, back to safety at levels of health. Alright, there you go. There's that item being... Um... Something I haven't really adjusted for. I feel, I feel like that flame just sucks, is really what that one comes down to. Like, I like a lot of the enemy- like, items that let you do that. I'm gonna try to, like, knock you into the... Thank you for getting rid of that one. There you go. Okay, so we lost all of our flames. Uh, I think D4 with this, uh, this book's kind of bad just because you can get that particular... Uh, flame type. That sucks as well that we just get that. Um, but we... we roll. Oh, we didn't get it. We have 44 damage. Because <laughs> we got Polythemus. Um, let's see what else we got. Just Immaculate Heart. That's why it's doing that. Um, a lot of damage of stat items just in general. <laughs> Cricket's head. That's That would be why it's the, uh, the damage is so high. Um... Is on top of all these high damage stat ups, uh, it's just being multiplied. That's a good reroll. I was very close to hitting me. Um, so do we stick with it? I thought for some reason you uh, that was I had to hit that thing to open the room. So then I walked off into the spikes again. I don't reroll, by the way. We got marked. Marked BF uh, magnet. That's a weird one. Um, it's honestly not a bad a bunch of bad stuff. I think these are honestly really good. The damage stat is not great. Um, all things considered. But um. I think we got like a lot of really good stuff. <laughs> as I as I blow up, I wonder what it was that just made me blow up. Um, do I fire mind? Oh, we, I'm just rerolling now because I just realized I had glass shard, and I still have glass shard apparently. Uh, that's unfortunate that that sticks with you after you get hit. Um. Good to know as well, um, while we're doing reroll strats. Is that that happens. We have Psyfly. 8 damage, 4 tiers. BF, double shot. Um, Vercaeus Veins is really strong. We have a reroll already. Because of, um, Habit giving it back to us. Uh, we'll be rerolling after we kill this boss. <laughs> this is most likely what's gonna happen. <laughs> I 
And, uh, yeah, there you go. There's a bone heart, which is actually really nice. Butt bombs, do this. See what's in it. Hopefully a damage card. Magician's not bad either. I'm gonna take Magician. Part of me wants to re-roll really bad. Probably could have left that other one on the ground there. Bobby Bombs, Purity. I think we're getting the range up from Purity. <laughs> that or it might be the damage. Do we have any other damage items? Uh, Dead Cat. Dead Cat actually, okay, did not reset my health down. So they fixed that. Um, so that means probably, um... Tainted Eden isn't, like, the worst character in the game. So I'm gonna say right now, uh, you're probably gonna move him up to A. <laughs> They they fixed the bug that I hated I hated playing Tainted Esau with so uh, or not Tainted Tainted Eden, um so I'm I'm like actually yeah put him on A tier now. Uh, that's red key which is a cool item. Probably not be a you know floor to use it on but it's still a cool item nonetheless. We have uh, we roll ready by the way. Let's try it. So might as well do it. Um so one speed by default we have range uh, laser um. I hope this is the one I get to beat, beat, beat Delirium with. Uh, um, why am I saying like, oh, I hope this is the one I get to fucking fight the boss with? Like, it's not like I don't have like, I have the option to stop hitting the space bar when I see it. I can make that choice. I'm a I'm an adult. <laughs> there he is. Might as well just hit the range up. Oh, we have, uh... We have that item. The one that increases your speed. That's a weird synergy, uh, right there. I can't see the tears. That killed my flame still. I thought invincibility, like, stopped him. Maybe it's just, like, the space bar items. Please blow up, thank you. That did a lot. <laughs> so this was like a run that was like we I think we were down to one heart several times. Um twice. Definitely at the end there. Uh, where it was risky. That was weird. Um and then we still ended up winning. I'm gonna say we won, because like what's the chances that like I get hit seven times here? Probably very little. Um but yeah, this is why I like D Delirium more than Mother. Because <laughs> the Mother fight sucks. Uh, Delirium wants you to have a build like this. So hey, we have uh, Eve's Mascara again. Oh, that was a fun run. Definitely not. Not I was about to say their names. Not allowed to do it. Um, this is just not doing it. I'm allowed to say them when I was referring to the tier list because um, that's not referring to the to a situation. Um, anyway, yeah. If you like, <laughs> so leave a like. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>